Hi, today it's going to be my monthly favorite and I know that I don't usually film every single month my favorites because when I have some new products which I find which works really really the best for me especially that month I really wanted to show you and because of that today I film my monthly favorite because my last month was so so in new products and some products which I find and come back for that products and blah 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 okay first I'm gonna start with the hair because I change my uh, color like every three to four months uh, in different color and kind of my hair is so dry and naturally super dry because it's kind of curly but I really really want to kind of keep it very healthy very very beautiful skin and uh, I get the new Can Care line intensive hair repair mask I use this mask for about three years right now and the last bottle last me for one month uh, one year and seven eight months which is so so a long time for one mask this is very very thick I got this last month and I started using that because my last one was kind of before four or five months and I needed a new mask and I come back for this it's very very thick cream very thick smell so so beautiful like creamy like creamy uh, milky something smell like uh, van vanilla something very very sweet beautiful smell and I, this is my favorite mask all the time and it's here it's kind of little bit expensive it's kind of $30 but definitely in USA other countries maybe you will find a little bit more non-expensive but uh, I really really think that worth it because every time when I put this on my hair my hair looks amazing so soft so smooth so healthy and i really love this if you can find this kind of caroline intensive hair repair get it because it's the best hair mask ever also because my garnier roll-on it's empty i need to to get one more and this is definitely not in my month favorite in it's in my ear favorite because I love this product and I use it every day and it works really really good especially on my dark super dark circles and right now I'm gonna talk about a little bit for the new products which I find last month and I really really love them one is Dr. Schiller natural effective anti wrinkle intensive serum uh, with argan oil looks like this and go with glass pipette bowl right here and it came with pipette and it's more like a liquidy it's not oil definitely it's not oil and uh, I really really love this and I see a result right about for a month I think and I really really love this product and goes so this is intensive repair and I put it before go to bed I clean my face I put around my eyes and under uh, and my neck and also right here around my mouth because you get the first wrinkles um, to show in your neck in, around your mouth especially mustache area right here and under your eyes and I find that my under eyes um, of uh, wrinkles it's kind of not that deep and it's kind of a little bit disappearing for about uh, one month using this and I really like it especially very very good for everybody who have oily skin because this is more like liquid uh, texture it's not oily at all and definitely if you have dry skin you must to put moisturizer all, all under this but if you have oily skin you can use it just uh, this uh, serum and I really love it and this was like $30 I think it's kind of little bit expensive but it's not that expensive because all the serums for other brands is super super expensive next I uh, you everybody know that I love my outer ring active 
but uh, it's kind of uh, lit my my skin is kind of a bit changing uh, for the weather. It, right now it's not that uh, super super dry. It start to be not oily but not that dry. And I find Clinique uh, dramatically different moisturizing lotion. This is in tube. And this is the first time I ever use something from Clinique. And I got a small 50 milliliters bottle because I wanted to first to try then if it's work to get the full big um, glass jar um, moisturizer and I really like it this is for very dry to dry skin and I find this is a lotion which in the first place I would say oh my god how lotion is going to give me enough moisturizer uh, moisturizing effect on my skin because I have super dry skin and this works really really good leave my skin very moisturizing and also it's very very works for me like primer I love it under my uh, foundation works like Perfectly. I don't get shiny on my T-zone when I use this. Looks very, very good your skin and I really like it. Definitely when it's going to be empty this bottle, I will gonna get the full size. Also my outer and cutan active I use in my night cream for my night cream because on my night kind of night care I want to be more creamy, more textured. Okay, next product, which is my monthly favorite. I Because it started to be so humid right here. It's kind of 30 degrees. So no degrees. Uh, 30 Celsius, which I don't know which. Okay, whatever. And uh, I wanted to use foundation, which is lightweight, which is not too much, like creamy, not too much heavy. And for about that, I using Maybelline Affinitone. Foundation, I love. This is one of my favorite, favorite foundation ever, especially for the summers because it gives matte finish and kind of lock that shininess on the T-zone and don't even move, stay all day long and I love, love, love this. I really, do, I think that Affinitone, maybe line, I don't know in USA, maybe the change the bottle or this is the kind of other products than usually have on Maybelline website. I try to find this, but I find it just on eBay. Yeah, and for kind of more heavier foundation, for especially for the night going, I use Vital Lumiere Aqua because this is kind of a little bit darker than my skin tone, and I wanted to use in the night when. It don't have too much sun to kind of see that my foundation goes on my neck and everything. But this is more liquidy uh, foundation I love because it gives most the natural looking skin. It's definitely light to medium coverage. It's not full at all. This foundation is medium to full. This is light to medium coverage but looks really really flawless on the skin. Uh, for Bronzer this month I using um, this product I use for bronzer, for blush and for highlight because it's kind of universal. This is Manhattan Highlighting Powder, Luminosity Shimmer Powder, looks like this. Came with three different colors, like uh, bronzy, golden and beige. I love the beige one in the middle for highlighting and when I mix everything with the brush, looks awesome like bronzer also with uh, like the blush. This is my favorite. Also, I have two blushes. Lately, I'm more, more in the brownish side, kind of golden brownish side. And for the blush, I like it. Some Bescu by MAC, which is kind of darker brownish, bronzy look. I really, really, <laughs> sometimes I use like blush, sometimes I use like bronzer, but definitely it's kind of darker for me, but I like it when it's pretty blended. And one more which is Dainty by MAC, which is very, very beautiful shimmery uh, blush. And I love it because it's shimmery. I love everything which is shimmery, which gives the highlight and glow to the skin. Okay, that was everything for kind of skin products. Uh, 
and now I'm gonna start with the eyeshadows this month I use just three eyeshadows and maybe four with the highlight okay now first is expensive pink by MAC oh my god I love love this color this is the most gorgeous pinkish um, copperish golden color uh, it's I think the most gorgeous color for the spring summer I love it because it's shimmery got a very very beautiful kind of sparkly effect but not too 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 much I love it and yogurt which I use most of the time to blend the expensive pink I love love this one because it's kind of mute color it's not that pinkish pinkish I love it and into my crease lately I'm using shell which is silvery purplish kind of color it's kind of duochrome color kind of I love it looks like this and I love this color for my crease I love it okay right here and vanilla eyeshadow of course for my brow bone area and lately most of the time I use my makeup forever aqua black eyeliner but this month I started using again Macroviolet by MAC which is beautiful purplish color especially with the expensive pink looks amazing and I get so much compliments this month for my makeup especially for the colors okay that was some that and uh, for the lips kind of I all the time use that eyeshadows and that blush and bronzer on my face every day this month but I kind of changing my lipsticks and that it was I don't know maybe because of that I have two four six seven products okay one of that is what is in my lips that is lip tar or this lip tar in femme love it this color it's so so amazing i love this color it makes my lips like so much bigger and fuller i love it uh next is um nyx this is hippie chic matte lipstick this it's more like orangey at sugar orangey it's kind of similar than my it's not similar it's the same color that uh, with my shirt I love it I absolutely love it but definitely I put lip gloss on top of it because it's super super matte and drying and I'm using this uh, this is umbrella umbrella I really don't know which brand is but it's the same um, a lip gloss with my shirt this is the lip gloss I love it smell like bubble gums I'm so so in love and this is the next lipstick which is Maybelline mango diamonds but this is kind of weird lipstick it's more like a lip gloss it's very sheer very sparkly very shimmery and very sheer lipstick it's definitely more like liquidy it's not that kind of it's not sticky at all but looks more like a lip gloss than lipstick which are weird next one this month I'm most in the sugary kind of um, orangey side colors this is by Moda and also it's kind of a little bit darker and not matte from the hippie cheek right here hippie cheek this is Moda in number 147 and it's kind of same the color but Moda it's more like uh, creamier and a little darker also the next which I use like every second day <laughs> this is L'Oreal you can probably see that I kind of need to get new one because it's kind of empty right now and it's satin pink 
which is my favorite. If you can find this um, L'Oreal, get it because it's the most creamier, most beautiful colors lipstick ever. And uh, for that hot pinks, I lately am using this one. This is Gosh Long Lasting Lip Marker. I love it because when you put on the skin, on the lips, stay like three days without washing. This is that. It's matte lip liker, and when it's dry, it's kind of can be move. You can eat lip. Uh, lick your lips and it's going to stay on the place that is that and one more product which is mascara I kind of changing my mascaras every month because I don't want to spend too much money for very very good brands of mascaras because every mascara is going to be that for about two weeks no too big two months and because of that I really want to try more non-expensive mascaras and this is my first time I ever ever get this. This is Maybelline Color Sol Volume Express Cat Eyes which goes with brush. I, I was expecting to be more bigger brush but it's very small like kind of a round brush and I love it. Definitely I love it. Right now I have it on my lips but oh not my lips. I have it but also I have false eyelashes and you will not be able to see it. The results but I love this don't kind of stick the eyelashes close together don't make it like um, uh, I don't know makes the eyelashes very full very big and kind of curvy and I love it and that was everything for my monthly favorite it's I know that it's super super long video but this month I was so so more in the product for the skin and I have so different products and because of that it's kind of be longish but yes thanks for watching and seeing the next tutorial and also you will see you will see this tutorial in my next video I think thanks for watching and see ya bye bye